guys what's up it's Ash and Jade and welcome back to my channel so today's the day before Halloween and I'm not even gonna lie to you guys um I don't know what I'm gonna be yet I have a party tomorrow night that I'm going to and I need to dress up so I got a bunch of cool stuff and I'm gonna try and put a costume together I have a few ideas in mind so like I don't not know what well, I mean I really don't know what I'm gonna be but like it's not that bad. I have some like really cool contacts. I got some fangs. Um, we just went to the Halloween store and got a bunch of stuff. Some blood and then I have a bunch of makeup. So I have a few ideas in mind and honestly I'm just gonna put some makeup on and figure out what I'm gonna be for Halloween. And I wanted you guys to help me. So that's what this video is and that's why I'm making it because procrastination is great. So yeah, let's get on into the video. Make sure to like and subscribe before you watch. And yeah, let's okay, go. Okay, so first I just put on like this shirt. I feel like this is like a good universal shirt for multiple things that I could be, like a vampire or a werewolf or something like that. Those are kind of my ideas. Um, but the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to put these contacts in. I don't have any like face makeup on, but I do have mascara on and my eyebrows done. So, um, pray for my mascara while I go put these in. I'll see you guys with some contacts in. Okay, so now I have these sick contacts in. Oh my gosh. I look like a snake. That's so weird. That's so trippy to see yourself with like a different eye color. I usually wear contacts like every year, but I never get used to it. They were supposed to be like kind of like a bright yellow, but they look kind of green in my eyes because my eyes are brown. But I mean, that's cool. It's so trippy. I look like I'm possessed. I literally look like I'm possessed. Okay. Well, now that I have those on, I'm gonna prep my skin. Okay, so now we're gonna figure out makeup. Um, I'm kind of just thinking of going with like what I usually do and then adding to that. So that's what I'm gonna do. Clean my face off a little bit. These contacts are so trippy. So I think I'm just gonna use some CC cream, just the IT Cosmetics. I just pump a little bit on everywhere. When I usually use this, I like to kind of combine it with like tinted moisturizer. It gives it like a more dewy look, so then I just use a little bit of that everywhere. And I don't really like to put like anything other than tinted moisturizer on my nose, because then I feel like it just looks cakey on me. Kind of a personal preference. Just blend that all together. So like I said earlier, I'm kind of going for like a werewolf or vampire look. Okay. My phone literally just fell off the table and I didn't even touch it. I definitely have a ghost in my house. It's fine. I mean, it is spooky season, so like, I'm not surprised. <laughs> okay, so I do that. Let's put some concealer on. I'm just gonna use the Naked Concealer. It's kind of like a figuring out if it actually looks good, like test run kind of thing. And I thought like, I'm doing it, so might as well film it. Okay, then I'm gonna set it with the Kat Von D Shade and Light Power, or Power, um, palette. I use the banana powder, the one in the middle. And then I'm just gonna bronze a little bit with the Too Faced Sun Bunny bronzer. Oh my gosh, this is literally my favorite bronzer ever. Okay, so this is what I'm thinking. I'm thinking of a werewolf, but if that doesn't work out, then I'm thinking go with a vampire. Because I saw this picture and like it was really cute and this girl was like, wearing like yellow contacts and then she had fangs and then she had like blood on her face so i'm kind of thinking of that look but if that look doesn't work out then like i feel like a vampire would look cool too 
And so for the werewolf look, like she had like a super bronzy face, which like makes sense. Cause like werewolf or like werewolves are brown and like hairy. And so like, I don't know, it just makes sense. So I'm gonna go hard with that bronzer. Okay, and then she did have a little bit of contour on her nose, which I noticed. So I'm just gonna do that with the Hula bronzer. And then I have like a mini one. Um, and then just this brush. It's for the werewolf look though. So we're kind of trying to go in a little bit darker. Let's see if this will blend it out. Let me blend this out. That looks pretty good. All right. So next, I'm just gonna add a little bit of highlight. I use the Milk Makeup Highlight Stick. So we'll just go with that. My eyebrows are already done. I'm gonna curl my lashes a little bit. So I like this look. I'm just gonna spray it with some rose water to kind of melt all the powder in. Okay, let's put something on my lips. Honestly, I'm just gonna put chapstick on for right now. Now let's move on to the fangs as the first thing you wanna do is position them. So put them where you want them, see if they fit correctly. Hold them there where you want them to go. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's a good spot. Okay. All right, so they come in this little package thing. I'm dropping everything. Um, it has like all this stuff in it. I'm not really sure what's going on here, but we're just gonna try this. Okay, so, um, I don't speak Spanish, wrong side. Okay, twist one capsule of powder apart, tap, pinch, and twist the ends of each side of the capsule into the carry case to empty completely. Okay. Snap off bottle twip and tip and squeeze for drops. So, comes with this little thing. I don't really know what it is. Stir with the wide end of the wood stick for 30 seconds to a minute. We're just gonna keep doing this. This smell smells like pure chemicals. I really don't think you should be putting this in your mouth. It is definitely getting dark in here. Okay, good. Let's turn this on. Ooh, that's really creepy. <laughs> ah. Hi. All right. Um, okay, so that took a lot longer than I thought, but um they turned out really cool. This is what they look like. Um they said that I have to like wait 24 hours for them to be completely dry. Okay, I'm gonna put my hair back because I don't wanna get that all over me. Okay. I'm just gonna put a little bit on my hand first. <gasps> okay, oh my gosh. <laughs> that squirted out a lot, okay. Um, I think I'm just gonna like use this to like pounce it on my face. All right guys, well, I just changed into a different shirt because I wanted to put some blood kind of like on my shoulder bones and stuff. That's not a shoulder bone. <sighs> on my collarbones. But um, I put some blood right here and like around my mouth and then put it dripping down here. And honestly, this looks dope. Like, not lying. I love it so much. But um, yeah, honestly, I don't know what I am. A werewolf. 
That's what I saw like a picture of Alexis Ren and it was really cute and she was a werewolf and they looked just like that. So, I mean, I could be a werewolf or a vampire to you. Whatever you think I look like, but yeah. Um, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Um, it's kind of late now, but yeah. Comment down below if you think I look more like a vampire or a werewolf. Like when people ask me what I am, what should I say? This is the look. All complete. This is so creepy. I look like a completely different person. Oh my gosh. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. Um, like I said, comment down below what you think this looks like. Um, and also, comment down below what you guys are being for Halloween because I want to see what you guys are being for Halloween. It's probably going to be stained on my neck. I just realized that. Ugh. And I have to go to school tomorrow. But it's whatever. <laughs> um... Yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you have an amazing Halloween. Um, stay safe. Yeah, all that fun stuff. See you guys later. Happy Halloween.